It's match time. Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith with you as always to describe it. And we're looking forward to something special today. Eh? Well, I think so, Martin. I hope these two teams won't disappoint us. Sheffield Wednesday today against Middlesbrough. As the league table shows, it's not very good viewing this for Stoke City fans. Thank you. The side have really improved and been really strong contenders. Difficult team to beat, but they've been rather too easy to beat, as this league table just reflects. Well, a lot of points still to play for, but um, they've been less than impressive, haven't they? Still time to make amends, but I don't know. A lot of ground to make up now. Certainly wanting to find a teammate, but he's just found an opponent. Let's look at Sheffield Wednesday and the list of their players here. It does look more like 4-4-1-1 than 4-4-2. Yes, I think so. I mean, it gives the manager the option. Has a go here! Sheffield Wednesday have a corner. And in it goes. Only partially cleared, so there's still some problems for them. Roy. Well, he could be the star turn in this game. He uh, really has enjoyed this competition, scored a lot of goals. They can be quick on the break now. a bit too hard trying to force the pass and it went uh, straight to an opponent Sheffield Wednesday will be hoping for victory today it certainly won't be straightforward for them though made the tackle and now the shot great save Middlesbrough's corner corner's taken there's still danger here after this half clearance Del Valle Roa. Ball back with Middlesbrough. Cordova. He's got his shot off now. And the ball knocked away long. Andrade. Castellani. And the referee says, that's a free kick. Just take a note of this, EA Sports coverage of the EFL Championship fixture. Sheffield Wednesday, they will be facing Queen's Park Rangers. Yeah, a lot of people have been talking about this one, looking forward to it. It's not a cross that's caused the defence any problems, and certainly not the goalkeeper. Good position, they've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Cordova. Iron Del Valle. Del Valle. He's cut it out. Right. The pass not completed, really. Let's fly! And it's in! That is one of those special moments you don't often see. A glorious goal. A strike of awesome power from an awesome player. And I've seen this player finish from those distances before. They've really got to close him down quicker. From the moment he hit it, you can see he knew it was going in. Middlesbrough then with the lead. That looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Adam Clayton. Ryan Shotton. Well, they're in a good position here. Adam Clayton. Johnny Housen. Ryan Shotton. 
Well, you can see what he was trying to do with the cross, but it's a goal kick. Iron Del Valle. Roa. Andrade. It was a foul, and the referees have seen the situation that he can play on. Good work from him. Johnny Housen. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Cleared away by the defender. Could whip it in from here. Cross from Stuart Downing. Goal! They lead by two now. Took the chance nicely. And that really has given them much more of a basis for the rest of this match. It's a classy goal, Alan. Well, it's come in from a long way out, and from that angle, it's not always easy to finish. Defenders caught out by it in the end. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Room now out on the wing. Andrade. Oh, that's good defending. Braithwaite. Johnny Housen. This is an exercise in patience as they try to get an opening. George Friend. Braithwaite. Martin Braithwaite. Cross from Stuart Downing. Fantastic goal! Great power with the header. Excellently placed, fine goal. Oh, it's fantastic timing, he gets up early. What an emphatic finish. I have to say, Alan, that reminded me of you in your prime. Oh, you're too kind, Martin, but it was a brilliant header, fantastic finish. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. And now the shot! The shot gets blocked. Iron Del Valle spotted that well and intercepted. The referee has and the verdict on added time is two minutes. Two minutes of added time. Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. He could cross it now. It's not a cross that's caused the defence any problems, and certainly not the goalkeeper. Johnny House. And the referee has signalled for half time. Has the Coming off the pitch. Well, we wait to see what the second half brings. The first half was conclusive, but you don't win the game at half time. Daniel Ayala, quick witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline. Interception here. Well, he's pressed him there to running the ball out of play. Castellani. Adam Clayton. Downing. Good interception. And the ball knocked away long. He's got his shot off now.
stopping the cross, important job for the defender. And it's gone out for... What a throw. Castellani. Here's Hector. Cordova. Really stretched to make the save. Top class. Now it's a corner. Corner played in. Well, it is merely a consolation here. Yep, no wonder he's celebrated. That goal really takes your breath away. Well, it was a, a really accurate corner and a fantastic finish by the boy. Just a reminder, 3-1 it is now, the scorer. Here's McNair. Daniel Ayala. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Good anticipation by the opposing player there to read the direction of the throw. Great weight. Well, they're building steadily here, working away. And shoots! That is a fantastic goal. Well, that is old-fashioned wing play at its best. What a cross. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. Here's a chance to whip it in. George Friend. Under some Scott pressure, he shielded Scott, it well. Really. Strong tackle, and the ball's gone out for a throw. Well, it's uh, one change, and it looks like it's a case of just trying to freshen the team up a bit. Now he's looking for support. Andrade. And the defender has blocked the cross, and he's done it well. Throw in to come. And the manager, Alan, is making this change here. Substitution will take place. Wonderful to watch. He took those two goals superbly well. Now Paddy McNair. And they've spread it out wide here. Roa. Well, then it goes. It's wonderful work from the goalkeeper again from the header. Well, he was on his toes. He was ready for it. Good stop. Downing anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. He's coming off now. He is a defensive midfield player, but you think he could play in all aspects of uh, that particular part of the pitch. He's certainly good on the ball. Yeah, he is. He's one of those. He's just a footballer, pure and simple, and he can play in a variety of positions. And this is his, his proper one, his, his favourite. And now the shot! No real trouble for the goalkeeper. I'm amazed, Alan, what we've watched, because couldn't split them when you talked about the teams at the start. Very similar players, very similar stats going into the game, but it's turned out to be one-sided. Well, it has. I mean, the scoreline would suggest that. In open play, I don't think there's been much to choose between the two, but it's the two sets of strikers that have been the difference. The way the winning side at the moment has taken those chances. We talked in the first half about how tight this game might be. Well, I'm afraid we led you down the garden path because Middlesbrough have shown the, an attitude and an aptitude for this fixture that I thought would be beyond them. Marvellous performance, and the scoreline shows that. Roa.
able to make a good interception. This has been called a football match, but it hasn't been much of a match-up between the two sides. The winners conclusively at their best, and the losers just aching to hear the final whistle now. Perhaps you can understand why that they're deciding to defend this position. Do you agree with it, Alan? Well, I think one of the strikers has been called to go back and help out with that defence. It's all hands to the pump now. On the move and able to cut out the pass. Probing pass. Out in front of goal. It's a goal! Well, it's one uh, good moment. day of many bad ones and they have got a consolation goal a goal from the very highest quality oh those kind of rebound goals I used to love getting them because it's all about anticipation plenty of goals for the fans here 4-2 off we go again the scorer will be very proud of this but it won't mean too much in terms of the result just a, a personal triumph for him I think so the opposition really had stopped playing because they know that they've won the game good vision it's close, Alan. Offside is given. He's quick enough. He doesn't need to do that. Well, that's over the top of the defender and one to chase. And shoots! Keeper controls it. Never looked like bouncing off him. It made it look easy, but his positioning did that for him. George Friend. The referee, the referee has chosen to add on two extra minutes. minutes well, we're down to the last minute here. Well played the goalkeeper. Good judgment, good hand. Well, that's going to be a free kick. Had to come back into his own half to get hold of possession here. He's blocked that well. Final whistle. 